Hey, what's going on, guys? It's me, Mike, and um, I wasn't sure if I was gonna make this video or not, so I guess you know I am. Um, now this video is about my contest, uh, my contest I just recently post, um, wallet design contest, and I just want to explain the rules a little bit so you guys can kind of understand because probably you know it is like uh, about to be midnight. I'm kind of tired and I feel good. And I just want to post this up because, you know, I just really want you guys to, um, you know, because I know a few graphic designers out there, a lot of people that do Photoshop. And I just want you guys to do something different while still designing at the same time. Um, so, basically the rules are, be creative. I want you guys to create something cool and unique and, you know, not too abstract, not too, you know, where nobody understands what the hell you designed and, you know, it's going to be on a wallet now. I want you guys to be unique and creative and I need you guys to be able to whatever graphic whatever thing you put make sure it's understandable make sure somebody can understand when they look at it they know what they're looking at um, so like um, that's part of the rules make sure it's creative and make sure the wallet has meaning to it the design has meaning to it so like I told you um, if you look at my wallet and you guys will see this on the, the event post and also on my website this is my wallet and um, let me check uh, you probably won't be able to see this well because you know I mean you could probably see it well now um, but that's my wallet and this is the back side of it and uh, this is the inside of it CMYK CMYK and as you can see my chase card is in there and uh, my little BJ's club membership card in there and you know my ID and everything else so pretty much you guys are gonna be designing a cool wallet and I'm gonna give the winner their created wallet so whoever wins the contest is gonna get their created wallet now this is how it's gonna go down when you guys create the wallet uh, I'm not gonna give it up to the people that enter to vote on who's wallet is the best that's not gonna wait going away where I'm gonna figure out a way that um a bunch of people will be able to vote on that wallet design and whoever wins maybe even deviant art deviant art is you know a broad artist out there so um I might try that I'm not sure yet but um, I'm gonna give it to where it's a broad crowd where everybody's watching and looking at your designs and um sorry if I sound stuff I sound horrible um, uh, basically, they're gonna look at your design and figure out which one, you know, is gonna be the best looking wallet. And I'm gonna do my little Photoshop skills to try to make it look like your wallet has already been, you know, printed and did all this other stuff. And I'm gonna give you guys a display. So once, you know, by the end, the, the end date is June 6th, but if I see that you guys probably need more time, just let me know. Um, but the, the end date is June 6th, so by then, with all your completed designs, um, I'm going to do a little Photoshop. And the images that I posted, I'm going to Photoshop my images in so you guys can kind of see how your wallets look. So it'll be like a, uh, you know, like a realistic uh, view of your wallet and how it will look. Um, so that's that. And, you know, it's going to be a, a voting poll where somebody's going to um, vote on your design and whoever wins is going to get that uh, wallet and also a cool Google Chrome theme made by me uh, it's going to be a CMYK Arts theme a black edition is called um, anyway so you can only enter once in this contest so you can't enter multiple designs and then multiple people enter on different designs you can only enter once so if you enter and you feel like your design could use a little more tweaking like you forgot uh, to enter this text in there or you forgot to add you know a certain graphic onto it you can do that but you can't do the whole redesign of it if you do the whole redesign then I pretty much might just you know not count your design at all because you know you're taking more time and then you know it's gonna be more time consuming people need to vote and things like that so you only enter once um, like I said you know you can't redo the whole design before the due date uh, explain why you chose that design at least write five sentences you know leave me a comment or under your design if you post it on Facebook um, yeah post your design on Facebook right and you know tag me in it so I can see it and write 
at least five sentences well why you chose that design why does that design have meaning to it and why did you choose it for a charity that you um, you chose to help people with so basically that's the other part you will have to choose a charity a charity as in you know you guys know what a charity is so let's say if there's a certain charity in your neighborhood or a certain charity that's you know well known or let's say uh, the breast cancer thing you know where uh, you create a wallet you know it's pink you got the ribbon you know I support uh, breast cancer Susan G. Susan G. Coleman things like that and my mom was a survivor you know whatever the case is um, you know why you you know self-explanatory right what, what I just said uh, why you chose that design and things like that you will write why you chose it and for what charity you chose and um, and if you are deciding to you know be unique and create your own charity if you if you had plans on creating your own charity and helping others let's say children and you want to help children read more in school and things like that or promote music in their school and you create let's say a, a wallet that involves music and it shows children playing music and, uh, and it shows schools getting involved and people holding hands things like that then you know that would be your charity you would need to prov uh, provide a name for that charity and uh, how would you go about like I said um, going about helping others with that charity so like I said if you're doing music how would you raise money or how would you you know do something to raise money to get children kids and schools to be able to play music who would you write who would you you know things like that and it's a little intensive but this is you know the point because you know designing a wallet and photoshopping is like in two seconds I know a lot of people that can do that within no time so I want you guys to kind of work on this because you know as graphic designers you, you know if you're doing something for a client or if a client is, wants you to do something you have to take the time out to do something and uh, I thought this would be um, a great experience if you guys are are thinking about doing some type of charity and stuff like that or giving back or whatever because I know a lot of people just sit back on their computers just designing doing this and this and this and you're not not really doing anything so I figured this would be a good start so if you are designing to help out something in your neighborhood someone in your neighborhood uh, you know, may, I mean, you may even win this wallet and decide to give this wallet to a, a, a kid that, you know, really needs a wallet. That probably doesn't have a wallet, you know. So, you know, I'm just, you know, thinking about all this cool cool stuff to uh, do. Um, kind of share with the community here. Um, so, let's say, alright, so we talked about giving a name to your charity. Um, or creating your own. Or, you know, whatever. Alright, and if the charity is for kids, please don't, you know, use graphic content. So if you, you know, if it's something for kids, you don't want to have, you know, some lady with her boobs out and things like that. And, um, you know, anything sexual, you know, if it's for kids, you know, you don't want to put that stuff on, you know. No, no death, no, no killing, no freaking, uh, gangs, none of that. Just, you know, straight, positive, clean design, alright? So that's pretty much it, uh. What am I in? Like six minutes now? Oh, eight minutes. All right. So I'm in eight minutes in this video. Um, I hope this was self-explanatory for you guys. Um, you know, uh, if this video looks alright, a little blurry, a little light. I don't know. Um, so that's it, you guys. Uh, it's me, Mike. I hope you guys really like my wallet design. Uh, let me put that over there. My little wallet design. And basically, this is how it's gonna go down. You guys are gonna have to create the front and back. I'm gonna give you the one template that's gonna be able to let you do the front and back. So you will basically, when you do the front, right? When you do the front, you want the front. You're gonna see an arrow pointing up or something like that. Like for for instance, for the inside, you're gonna see an arrow pointing this way because you're gonna want your design to, you know, if your design is looking like this, you want your design to be pointing inward you know so if you have something there you kind of get the, the gist of what I'm saying so it's gonna be pretty much a half of the design so let me see I want to do it sorry so like the half of the design so whatever the design is on the uh that little triangle that's on the template you want to put that there and the other side you want to put whatever design or text or words or something on this side and when you turn it over um uh, 
your design front is going to be this, and then your design back will pretty much be the same thing, but you know, your back will be whatever. So, um, just let me know, I'll show you guys how it's going to look when you're done with it, and hopefully, you guys can uh, understand my whole point of this contest and everything like that. So, remember, it's me, Mike. Be creative as always, uh, make something really cool, unique, and I'll see you guys later. Peace. Make sure you subscribe if you do watch this video for the first time and you know some of my videos and seem like this is really interesting and really going forward. You know, please subscribe and thumbs up this video. I really need all the support. I'm trying to become a YouTube partner and further my uh, art and design and graphic design and everything to share with you guys. Also, please visit my website. The URL used to be cmykarts.com. I'm working on changing that soon once I get enough money to uh, renew, uh, put back on my domain name. Uh, so basically, go to mikesdesigns.ning.com. Uh, sorry if I sound a little funny. So the link will be in the video description for my website. So please check that out. Uh, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.